This drone here is so ahead of the market, it doesn't even have a model name. Have you ever failed? Damn. Uh. I met the boys who own this business through Rice Farming TV, and today we're going to demonstrate how this completely autonomous drone can apply herbicides or pesticides to rice fields. Let's check it out. Yeah. Kevin here has set up the mobile base station and connected it to the monitor here. Ready to go. Charles has a surveyor. He's going to mark off four points around the field, which will create a digital map and communicate with the monitor, the home base station, and the drone. Let's go. Yeah. Uh. Yeah. Now that everything's been synced up, Charles is here at the filling station loading an 8 liter cartridge for the drone's payload. Uh. Yeah. Uh. So a couple things just happened there. Charles loaded up the canister. The drone can automatically sense how much volume is inside it. Also, he loaded on the battery. The battery propels the entire drone's flight and the spray application, and one battery lasts about 15 minutes. And this drone here can travel at a speed from 10 to 25 feet per second, meaning that in a single run, it can cover about two acres. So the boys are putting on the propellers now, but before they started, they completely ran the system making sure that the battery life was good, that the spray nozzles were spraying correctly, and that the motors were all running. Everything is connected and running well, and so now, once the propellers are on, we're ready for takeoff. Have you ever failed? Automation on this bad boy is incredible. Completely autonomous. Kevin's just monitoring it over there. He knows exactly how much volume is left inside the canister. He knows how many acres he's gone. He knows the battery life. He knows everything. If the volume of the material gets too low, the drone will automatically return to the home base. Uh. Yeah. Uh. Right now, the drone's flying at 10 foot passes, about eight feet off the top of the canopy of the rice. So it's extremely low, out of danger of any crop dusters, which makes it super awesome. Also, another safety feature is the drone can detect any obstructions or movement that are too close to it, and it'll actually pause in flight, turning off, of course, the spray booms. At a moment's notice, the drone can turn off its spray application and return to base, memorizing where it left off to continue once it's safe again to continue. Guys, I could watch this drone fly all day. It's absolutely amazing where technology is. I'm so happy that Rice Farming TV put us in contact together. I'm so happy that we could present to the viewers cutting edge drone technology in agriculture. If you guys want more information, please contact us. Otherwise, remember to give a thumbs up, like, subscribe, comment down below if you guys got any questions. Have a great day.